Welcome to BAC TV Network and our new owners tutorials. And in this tutorial, we're going to go to how to go live on your smartphone. It's either iOS, which is Apple smartphones, and as well as uh, Android. Thank you for tuning in. The first one we're going to go through, we have three of them I'm going to show you. And the last one is the one I'm going to recommend that you use. But I wanted to give you a couple options just in case. Uh, the first two are Android only and the last one is both available for Android and uh, iOS uh, Apple uh, uh, Apple uh, smartphones so the first one is called Livebox uh, satellite streamer so you would go to Google Play Store and once you go to the Google Play Store you would type in the search box right here you would type in Livebox satellite streamer and then when you find it it'll pop up and then you open it up, and I've already installed it on my smartphone, so it's there. As a matter of fact, I'm recording on a uh, on a um, on my computer, so it's going to look a little bit different uh, on your smartphone than I am on my computer because it's a little bit wider. So you'll see that it's off a little bit. So what you would do is you would click, of course, to install, and then you install it. Um, it's very simple. You would put in the RTMP, which you'll find on your. Let's go there. Uh, let's go here to your client portal. And then this area right here is your URL and your stream key. These are very important. Don't anybody see your stream key? Um, that's your that's your that's like your door for folks to be able. That's your that's your password for you to be able to get in and out. But this is where you would go. So you would go there and put the information in. And again, I'm just showing you this one because it's one of the alternatives that you can use just in case. And the next one, L A R I X broadcaster. It's Lyrix uh, Broadcaster, same thing, on Google Play Store, open it up, same thing, install, it's installed on my phone, but I'm on my, because my account's tied into my, to my Google, it shows up as it's installed because it's actually installed on my phone. So what you would do is the same thing, and then you just walk through the basic instructions on how to do when you go live uh, from that as well. But the one that we're going to uh, show you how to use is the next one, it's called Streamlabs. Uh, OBS and this is available on both Android and Apple and then this is you do the same thing you would open it up and then you would install it and then uh, we'll show you how it works now in this video uh, tutorial we're going to show you how to uh, be able to stream from your mobile phone or your tablet this is specifically for Android, and then we'll have a different tutorial on what software to use for uh, iOS or Apple. So what you would do is you go to the Google Play Store, and then you will put in Streamlab. Uh oh, gotta learn how to spell. Streamlabs, and then it'll pop up. I've already installed it, but what you'll do is you'll hit install, and then it'll go through and install. Then once it's installed, then the next step is to go ahead and open it up. Once you open it up, it gives you um, several places that you can uh, log into to be able to stream directly from uh, those platforms. But what we're going to do, say for instance you're out and about and you want to stream real quick uh, to Facebook, then you just put in the information of Facebook, YouTube, or this one's a Twitch. But what we want to do today, I'm going to show you how to set it up for Restream, which is part of the software package that is located in your client portal on uh, BACtelevision.com. So what you do is you will go there and you would grab the, open it up, and then on the top, uh, I'm going to, I'll, I'll go out of the screen and, and go back over, but I'm recording this on my phone so you can see actually how to do it from the phone. But what you do is you will go to, and you would go to other platforms, and then when you see it, it takes you to, it says, please set up your RTMP, which is what you want to set up to be able to use Restream, the Restream to Facebook, YouTube, and whatever other platforms you want to go to simultaneously once you get your phone set up, once you get it set up on your phone. So that's why Restream is better than just going live on YouTube or Facebook because the, the power of BAC TV and using Restream is that you can go to multiple um, destinations all at one time. So I've already copied and pasted. I mean, I copied the information, so I'm going to pull it up real quick, and uh, you can see it. It's okay. Um, you will copy. You will copy. There we go. 
copy that information which is your streaming URL which is asking for here so you would do that there you would copy and you would paste it there and then you go back and do the same thing with your stream key as we mentioned in the other videos don't let anyone see your stream key so that way it protects you so one else is being able to stream on your account um, but for the sake of this is our demo site anyway so if you want to stream on a demo site you're welcome to and then you'll hit continue and then it says en enable camera and mic and you say yes and then you hit allow and you allow and then now you're set so you're actually stream you know if you hit go here if you see that little red button if you hit stream if you hit that then it'll actually go live I don't want to because I'm streaming live on that channel that's our, that's our church channel but that's how you use uh, your once you get it set up, then you just go back and forth there all the time for you to, you know, anytime you want to go live, you're able to go live. Um, some of the other things you need to know, uh, if you have those, you know, the three, like, three straight lines, it gives you some other great resources. I would say we're not going to go into all that information today because I just wanted to make to get you up and running to be able to stream, and that's how you do it on using O uh, Streamlabs OBS. <laughs>